Hey everyone, it's been a little while since I've done a video, I, but uh, I had four items sell within the past few days, so packing them up, I thought I would not knock out a quick video. This is a late 60s uh, board game, Regatta. Uh, it's uh, by 3M, and it's one of their uh, sports games. Um, still in, in excellent condition, no tears or rips or anything like that. Uh, and the nice thing is it... Uh, has all the pieces and the books and the directions and everything looks like it's never been used, which probably fairly standard. I suppose folks buy things and just never use them and put them aside somewhere. So I picked this up in an estate sale for four or $5 and this one sold for 27 bucks plus fees. So here is a uh, 124 scale die cast um, Johnny lightning series vehicle uh this is a 1971 plymouth duster and uh this one sold for 65 dollars plus shipping and tax uh picked this up off craigslist in a in a collection a guy was selling a collection of die cast vehicles uh hot wheel size vehicles some models that he had put together as well as some models still in the box and uh, had the whole collection up on craigslist and uh i thought oh this you know Pretty nice opportunity. Spent a little more money, but um, I am I am on the plus side for this. Made all my money back within a couple months, and uh, now on the plus side with still plenty to sell. So, good times. So this is what I guess it would be uh, new old stock. Um, this is a uh, I guess it's Spider brand. It's a it's a uh, theater calib home theater calibration device. Um, still new in the package. Um, you can see it's uh, all nice and, and still sealed up and whatnot. Um, picked this up in an online auction for just a couple dollars. I think somebody was basically selling the remnants of uh, an older camera store in the area. Perhaps the owner had uh, closed it down and just taken everything home. I don't know. But um, got this for a few bucks and sold it for 25 plus fees. And lastly, uh, I've got this uh, uh, comic book and record set. These were done by Powered Rec Power Records. Uh, 1974 was the year on this one. Uh, this is uh, this is number 13. Comes with a 45 record. There it is. And uh, and then a comic book. And uh, I remember having some of these new. Uh, well, yeah, I guess they were new. Um, and so I uh, I scored a bunch of these, about eight or nine of them at an estate sale uh, about a week ago. I was at an estate sale. I had almost uh, given up for the day, but I thought, well, I'll hit one more and uh, scored, I think, pretty well. Um, ended up finding these on a top shelf in a closet behind a, of a, behind a bunch of other old books that I just think nobody wanted to look past and um, found nine of these as well as some other uh, not regular comic books, but collected comic books. So, um, and I got them for a buck a piece, which was awesome. So, um, I believe this is the fifth one I've sold, uh, the, the non superhero ones of these sell a little bit quicker. Um, and for a little bit more money, this one was just 15 bucks, but you know, I paid a dollar. So, uh, who's complaining? 